Hi there, welcome back to my channel. My name is Violeta. I am a technology and lifestyle expert. My professional background is engineering and IT, but I love fashion and I designed my own couture in my spare time. Today, I want to share in this video my very first collection of resort wear. It was the beginning of my journey in fashion design, so I want to revisit my work by sharing them with you today. Style Caridad is inspired by my grandmother, so this four-piece ensemble is named after her. When I was a little girl, she always got me to use a headpiece, a shawl, and a pouch. She made the pouches herself by hand. My friends and I were holidaying in Melbourne and were having a sumptuous breakfast in Cliveden, the hotel bar and restaurant at the Pullman Melbourne on the Park. And I was wearing this four-piece ensemble for the very first time over breakfast, so I decided to name my outfit Cliveden. Style Eloisa is named after my cousin. Eloisa is more than a cousin to me, she is a sister who I grew up with bright elegant simple but truly beautiful she was crowned our hometown's queen when we were in high school my cousin eloisa was in my thoughts when i created this three-piece ensemble style wayanba is named after the street where my photographer at the time stayed overnight for this fashion shoot we stayed at a friend's house nearby the beach and we enjoyed a simple bonding and get together Wayanba is a six-piece ensemble that includes a two-piece swimsuit, a top, cap, beach bag, and cardigan. It's a perfect outfit for an all-day beach outing. Bolet is my childhood nickname. I named this three-piece ensemble after me because it reminds me of my young self and my love of fashion at a very early age. I remember that my grandma used to take me with her to buy my clothes. Andrea is my friend's daughter who was the 18th birthday celebrant of a party that I attended and I wore this five-piece ensemble. It includes a beret, top, shorts, a wrap-around skirt, and a pouch. It's a trendy, elegant outfit for any party. Gumamela is my native dialect's translation of the flower hibiscus. I named this style Gumamela because of the fabric print that reminds me of my hometown in the Philippines. My auntie used to have a lot of gumamela in her garden, and I remember dismantling the petals and pretend to sell them when my cousins and I played. It reminds me of my early interest in fashion, sales, and entrepreneurship. Style Rafaela is named after the photographer who took this photo. It was my first photo shoot, and it opened my eyes to the value of fashion and photography. Raffaella includes a beret, a top, a Janie pants, and a pouch. Style Hyde is named after the park where this fashion photo shoot was taken. Hyde is the perfect outfit for a stroll in the park on the weekend or on a holiday. The four-piece ensemble includes a headband, a long dress, a sleeve wraparound, and a shoulder bag. I wore this outfit to an unplanned outing in the park. Out of the blue, my photographer and I decided to do a photo shoot of my latest creation. Hence, I named this ensemble Unplanned. The six-piece ensemble includes a cap, top, shorts, jacket, belt pants, and an oversized carry bag. Susanna is named after my cousin who is also my sister. I grew up with her in my hometown in the Philippines. Intelligent, simple, industrious, kind-hearted personality. I thought of her when I designed and made this creation. The five-piece ensemble includes a wide-brimmed hat, top, shorts, handbag, and matching sandals. Style Riley is named after the street where I had my very first fashion photo shoot. I was wearing this outfit when I arrived at the studio, a very comfortable wear when driving long distance during summer. This five-piece ensemble includes an oversized sleeve shawl and handbag, beret, top, and shorts. 
Style Wolemi is named after the Wolemi pine trees at the Royal Botanic Garden where I had this fashion shoot. This two-piece ensemble that includes a top and a long skirt reflects my love of plants. I call this two-piece ensemble Beyond. It was beyond my imagination to be modeling my own couture and having a fashion shoot. It's an eye-opening experience for me and today I see the value of using fashion and photography in creatives. I appreciate my photographers who believed in my work and who encouraged me to go beyond just wearing my own couture but showing it to the world. Style Rufina is named after my beloved mother. My mother was quiet and reserved on the outside, but inside her is an explosion of passion, love, sacrifice, unwavering faith, industry, and fullness of life. She was in my thoughts when I created this three-piece ensemble, reflecting her bigger-than-life existence and extraordinary faith and conviction. I believe that simplicity is the seamless integration of elegance and sophistication. This is the foundation of my every couture creation. I don't sell them. However, I want to teach people how to create. In my next videos, I will be giving tutorials on specific areas of fashion design and creation. So if you have not done so, subscribe to my channel so that you will be notified when I post a new tutorial. Just click on the subscribe link and let's stay connected. I shall see you in the next video.